Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? Elder Rose Gaming here. Not exactly. Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? Edwards Gaming here. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download an X ray pack for Minecraft mining. So, everyone has been requesting this on my X ray tutorial on how to see mobs and chests through the ground. But this is going to be a new type of x-ray that you guys have been asking for. How to look at ores through the ground. So pretty much what this mod does is it makes dirt invisible. And the same thing with uh, andesite, granite, and all that. And stone, as you can see. I could see all the ores. There's some uh, iron right there, some coal. Uh, but if you were deep enough, you would be able to see diamonds. But yeah, without further to do, I'm going to show you guys how to download an x-ray pack for ores on your Xbox One. Also, if you guys want to download other mods, I have all of my tutorials for different types of mods linked in the description. So make sure to check those out. Okay, so the first step in order to download this mod pack, you're actually going to have to go into your settings on your Xbox and then go over to display and sound go to video output and then on the in the middle video fidelity and overscan once you get here you're going to make sure that there is no check mark inside of this box boom that's what it looks like with it boom that's what it looks like without it make sure there is no check mark because if there is a check mark in there you will not be able to install the two mods that I'm gonna show you how to download okay so the second thing you're going to need is go to my games and apps and make sure that you have all four of these apps downloaded. And if you do not have them, you can get them from the Microsoft Store, Easy Peasy Lemon Squeezy. So you're going to need File Downloader, File Explorer, Microsoft Edge, last but not least, one of the most important ones you're going to need is UFO.transfer. So once you make sure you have all four of these, you're going to open up Microsoft Edge and navigate yourself onto this website right here. I will put a link in the description for both of these media fire links. And if you're watching this on the phone or on another Xbox, I'm going to paste it on the screen. If you misspell anything, you will not be able to get to this website and it will not work. But once you are finally on this website, you're going to hover over the download rectangle that is all green and then you're going to push the pause button aka the button with the three lines and then you're going to press copy link once you copied the link you're going to open up one of the apps that I told you to download and it's called file downloader once file downloader is done loading up you're going to click the three lines at the top left and then click on from URL and then you're going to click on local storage and then you're going to hover over right here where it says enter or paste it here and press the pause button aka the button with the three lines and if it didn't work then push B go back on it and then press pause again and then it'll say paste that's when you push A and paste it and then you're going to click the arrow on the right side that's pointing down once you do that, you're going to click the big rectangle that says start at the bottom of your screen. And then, boom. There you go. That's how you download the first pack. So you're going to want to close file downloader. Make sure you close it. And then open up Microsoft Edge again. And then navigate yourself over to this other website. Not this one. This one right here. You're going to want to copy the link at the top or if you're having trouble reading that I'm going to edit it in in the screen and if you guys are uh, watching me on Microsoft Edge or your computer link in the description for this link alright so once you're done typing the link in and you finally get here heads up it won't work if you misspell anything uh, hover over this rectangle again and then press the pause button aka the button with the three lines and then copy link we're going to do the same thing again. Open file downloader. Once it's done loading, you're going to click the three lines at the top left and then click from URL. Once you are in here, once again, click local storage and then click uh, the pause button, aka the button with the three lines up here again and then paste it and then click the arrow on the right side of your screen once again and then like I said before, once again, press start. 
to download it. Once you have both of these downloaded, you're going to click the three lines at the top left and then press storage and then click on local storage. And then right here, as you can see, we have them both, the night vision and the useless x-ray. The reason it's called useless x-ray is because it x-rays, but you cannot see the blocks because of how dark it is. But with the night vision, there you go. Problem solved. So the next step is you are going to click the check mark on the night vision and then you're going to click the three dots at the bottom right of your screen and then rename. Make sure you push the right bumper and then erase the dot MC pack and change it to dot zip. So we're changing it from a dot MC pack to a dot ZIP and then you're going to click OK. And then we're going to do the same thing for the useless x-ray. Click the check mark and then go to the bottom right and then click on the three dots and then rename and then right bumper and then erase MC pack and change it to Z I P. Boom. There you go. Click OK. All right. So now what you're going to do is you're going to go up here and type in N I G H T B I S I O N. All right. Once you type that up there, you're going to click the three dots once again at the bottom right and then click new folder. And then you're going to push the B button once the folder is created. As you can see, we just made this folder right here, night vision. We're going to do one more for x-ray. So you're going to click the, the huge rectangle again. Type in, uh, I'm going to name it O-R-E space X-R-A-Y or x-ray. That way you can tell it apart from any other x-rays that you have installed. Uh, so once you do that, you're going to click the three lines again, press new folder, and then push B. And there you go. We have two new folders, the night vision folder and the or x-ray folder. Now, you're going to open, you're going to want to click on the words night vision pack, you know, the, the zip file that you created, open that up, and then you're going to click the three lines with the check marks in the square at the bottom right of your screen. And then you're going to press the thing on the left of it, where it's like a paper pointing to another paper. Boom. Once you click on that, you're going to go back. You're going to click on the night vision folder, open it up, and then you're going to click the clipboard at the bottom right. What this is going to do is it's going to paste all of the files into that folder. And then same thing with the x-ray. We're going to click on the useless x-ray zip file, open it up, and then open the folder inside of that folder. And then once you see the blocks JSON and the readme text, you're going to click the same thing at the bottom right, the three lines with the two check marks in the square, and then click on the paper pointing at the paper right to the left of it. Boom. Once you do that, you go all the way back and then you click on the or x-ray folder that you created. And then you're going to click the clipboard at the bottom right. Boom. Same thing. You're going to paste all of it inside of the folder you created. So once you have done all this, you are going to open up the other app that you downloaded called UFO Transfer. Once UFO Transfer loads up, if you do not have this at the top right of your screen, this gear icon, that means that you skip the first step. Rewind the tutorial, watch the first step to find out what I'm talking about. All right, but if it is there for you, Click on the gear icon at the top right and then click on this rectangle right here that says open in file explorer. So pretty much it's going to allow you to access files that you normally cannot access through your fire explorer. So at the top you're going to want to click packages once this loads up and then find the Megascopes universal file. It's going to have a bunch of numbers in the beginning of it. It might take you a while to find it. It might not. It depends. So yeah, once you find this folder, the megascopes.universal file folder, open it up and then go into local states. And right here, as you can see, we have our or x-ray and our night vision. First, we're going to move the night vision. So hover over night vision and press the pause button, AKA the button with the three lines. And then you're going to copy. All right, now you're going to go back at the top, go to packages. 
Now you're going to want to find the Microsoft.Minecraft UWP console file, aka folder right here. It might take you a while to find it. It might be on the left for you, but for me it's on the right. So once you find it, you're going to open it up, go into local states, games, Mojang, right here. If you do not have resource underscore packs, you can create it. Uh, it will not work unless you have this folder in here. So if you don't have it, make one. Click this paper with the plus sign and then name it resource underscore packs and then click OK. And once you have this folder, open it up. And then at the bottom right, you are going to click the paste button. Boom. As you can see, there you go. Now we have the night vision. So we're going to do the same thing with the x-ray. So press B, press B again. And then at the top, you're going to go back to packages and then go into the mega scopes as we did before. And then we're going to go to local states and then go to or x-ray, press the pause button, aka the button with the three lines and then copy, go back at the top, click on packages and then go down till you find Microsoft UWP console. Open that up, go to local state again, and then games, Mojang, resource packs again. Like I said, if you don't have the resource pack folder, create it. And then you're going to click the paste button, aka the clipboard at the bottom right of your screen. And there you go. We have the OR X ray and the night vision. Next thing you're going to want to do is open up Minecraft and equip the texture packs on the world where you want to X ray on. Once your Minecraft loads, you're going to click play and then go to the world where you want to equip the resource pack on it and then click the pencil on the right of the world. Now you're going to go down to resource packs and then find the useless x-ray, put that one on first and then the second one you're going to equip equipped over the x-ray is the night vision pack. There you go. Make sure the night vision is on top of the x-ray. And then you're going to click. Also, if you want your friends to be able to see it, make sure to click this check mark above active packs to require. And then your friends can like also see, you know, the X-ray pack. But yeah, next you're going to click play, load the world up, and you will be able to see through stone, dirt, andesite, granite, etc. I have a little tunnel right here. So yeah, if it. Oh, wow. Look at this. We can see through everything. Wow, all these ores that I live around and I've never mined. That's insane. You can also see the water outside. Bro, I wonder if there's any diamonds I've never gotten. This is insane. Lapis right there. What else? Yo, there's some emerald. Is that diamond? I think that's diamond. <laughs> Wow, this is so awesome. This is crazy. Wow, can I get out right here? Yep, you gotta be careful with the lava, man. You gotta be careful with that lava. But there you go, guys. I mean, if it didn't work for you guys, that means you possibly accidentally skipped a step or you misspelled something. So make sure you do everything thoroughly. If this ended up working for you guys, make sure to hit that like button. It helps the channel out a lot. I'm trying to grow. Also, subscribe if you enjoyed. I'm going to be uploading a lot of Minecraft mini games, survival games, and I'm going to start a Minecraft Let's Play very soon. So, please subscribe. And if you guys want to see a bunch of other mods you can get on your Xbox One, there will be a link to each of them in the description. But yeah, I mean, without further ado, thanks for watching. Peace!